Hello and welcome back to Pokemon Red. This is technically episode two, and in the last episode, we left off the starter choice where I let you guys vote on which starter I should choose as my Pokemon starter, and I have the results of the poll I did. Um, so yeah, we had a total of 14 people vote. Um, yay. That's actually quite a lot, to be fair, considering I only normally get about 5 views per video. So thank you for everyone who voted. Um, I can tell you that Kabuto did not win. Kabuto got a, a measly one vote. Um, and it came very close between Jinx and Gengar. Uh, I believe this was Jinx, right? So that means this was Gengar. Well, I can tell you that Gengar is the one we'll be picking, as it got seven votes, whereas Jinx only got... six. So like I said, it was very, very close, but not that close. So we will be choosing Gengar as our starter. Darren received a Gengar. Do you want to give it a nickname to the Gengar? Now, we nicknamed our Ghastly that we caught in Lavender Tower in uh, Pokemon Blue. We nicknamed him Stay Puffed, um, if you remember that. But I think we're going to go for a different uh, Ghostbusters reference this time, and we're just going to name him Gozer. So Blue gets the Kabuto. Now I have said it so that he should keep his starter through the whole game, I think, so um, Kabuto will be popping up quite a fair bit. Wait, Daron. Let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. Dun 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 It's battle time. Blue wants to fight. Blue sent out Kabuto. Go, Gozer! Whoa! Ooh, look at these moves. Now, is Nightshade the one that does damage each through your level? I don't remember. That was a crit. That was pathetic. Scratch. LOL! Boom! Paralyzed! Noise! Come on, Gozer, we can get this scrub. Ah, fully paralyzed! He's hardened. What a scrub. Let's try Nightshade, because I'm not sure what that does. I think it's the one that does damage equal to your level. Oh, damn! Kabuto got wrecked! You what, mate? <laughs> I just completely skipped level 6, apparently. What? Unbelievable. I picked the wrong Pokemon. Look at all that money. It's not really that much. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon fight to toughen it up. Darren Gramps, smell you later. Do I have to talk for a short now? I don't remember what voice I gave him. Darren! Raise your young Pokemon by making it fight! Okay. Bye bye. I remember what voice I gave Now, for those of you who do not know how Nuzlocke to work, obviously uh, you have to catch the first Pokemon you encounter in each area. But as I currently do not have any Pokeballs, I'll prove I don't have any Pokeballs. I just have this potion. Um, I obviously can't catch anything yet, so all my encounters up until I get Pokeballs do not count. Um, so I can encounter things on this route and be fine. But that does mean that we get a quick sneaky sneaky peeky at this Rhyhorn that we could encounter as our first encounter. Oh damn, is all I can say to that. Um, oh my, I don't think we want to fight him. <laughs> I don't know, I don't think we want to fight him. No, no, no. So let's head to Viridion City. Ooh, what else is on this route then? Oh, uh, another Rhyhorn. Rhyhorn. I didn't set it to equal strength, so we could literally just be finding Mewtwo's on this route, by the way. Yeah, you know what, we're gonna lick it and see what happens. Try and boost that EXP. CRITICAL HIT! 
it. Newt, newt. Ah. 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 Oh, this guy literally only has one attack, doesn't he? Okay. Well, well he's dead. Goja grew to level 8. We don't want him too high leveled yet, so we might just leave him there until we've got our next encounter, which will probably, by the looks of things, be a Rhyhorn. Or a Shelder! Level 2. Okay. No, I don't want to fight that. Noot, noot, noot. Come on, Gengar. The only thing with Gengar is, being a final evolution, he doesn't really learn that many moves. Uh. Sure, let's see when the Pokemon Center. The Pokemon Center in every town ahead. They don't charge me one either. That's nice of them, isn't it? Heal my Gengar, please! Heal Goza. Goza! Thank you, your Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again! I remember our right we have to go to the Mart. Hey, you came from Pallet Town. Yes, I did. Very perceptive of you. You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Will you take it to him? And I've got Oak's parcel. Let's go give Oak his Oak's parcel. Isn't there a guy down here who gives you a potion? This guy. Yo, B, give me a potion. Hi, I work at the Pokemon Mart. It's a convenience shop, so please visit us in Viridian City. I know, I'll give you a sample. Here you go. And I got a potion. Mmm. Free potion. Yo, Oak, I got a parcel for you. Is my old Pokemon. Well, it seems to like you a lot. You must be talented as a Pokemon trainer. What? You have something for me? Derek delivered Oak's parcel. Ha! Ah, this is the custom Pokeball I ordered. Thank you. Grabs. What did you call me for? All right, I have a request for y'all too. He's going kind of hillbilly again. On the desk there is my invention, the Pokedex! It automatically records data on the Pokémon you've seen or record. It's a high-tech encyclopedia! Darren and Blue, take one of these with you! Darren got the Pokedex from Professor Oak. Boom. To make a complete guide on all the Pokémon in the world. That was my dream. But I'm too old! can't do it, so I want you to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two! This is a great undertaking in the Pokemon history. Alright, Gramps, leave it all to me. Darren, I hate to say it, but I don't need you. I know, I'll borrow a time map from my sis. I'll tell her not to lend you one. Ha 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 ha. Fwa ha 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 Psych, she's gonna give me one anyway. How'd you feel? Hey, give me a town map. Uh, shall I give her a voice? No, she, this is like the only time we see her ever. Grandpa asked you to run an errand. Here, take this with you. This will help. Oh! Look, I got a town map. Mm -hmm. Alright, we can go get Pokeballs now, I believe. Which we still currently don't have, so this is still a non and void counter. Whoa, it's a Whippin' Bell! What did we name our Victory Bell in the other game? The Bell Sprout. Oh, it was Old Bean! We could get Old Bean! Bean, Bean, Bean! Scoot, scoot, scoot. So, we know there's Shelders, Weeping Bells, and... Rhyhorns on this route. And Dug Trios! There's everything, is literally everything on this route. 
run, run, run. Hopefully we don't kill our encounter, that would be very sad. Sad time. Hopefully you guys like Gengar, because we have a Gengar on our team. And hopefully he will be staying for a fair amount of time, considering everything. Hey, B, give me some Pokeballs. Uh, five should do. One thousand. Here you are. Is there anything else I can do? Thank you. Dankushan! Should we go talk to the old man and learn how to catch Pokemon? Because I clearly don't know how to do that. Oh, you don't have to talk to him. Lol! Right, so let's go get our first encounter! And it's going to be... A Weeping Bell! Well, Weeping Bell appeared. Now, is the Weeping Bell going to have high, more than 8 HP? I'm assuming it's going to, so I'm going to Nightshade. Ooh, it went to yellow! Use growth, it's special gross. If I lick it, will it die? Please say no. Woohoo! It didn't die! And it's paralyzed! It used growth. Mm, I think I'm gonna get this thing. Oh, go, Pokeball! Alright, Weeping Bell was caught! A new Pokedex data will be added for Weeping Bell. Weeping Bell. It spits poison powder to immobilize the enemy and then finishes it with a spray of acid. Do we want to give a nickname to the Weeping Bell? Of course I do! And throw back to the LP we literally just finished, we're gonna name him Old Bean. Because it's the only name for a Weeping Bell on this channel now. Old Bean! Bean has returned for round two. He was a very valuable asset to our team in the last LP, so hopefully he'll make a decent addition to this team. Let's check him out, actually. Stats. He's paralyzed. He's got one HPs. Uh, he has Vine Whip, Growth, and Rap. Not bad, not bad. Let's heal him up a bit. Uh, I'm gonna put him on the party for now, just as we only have two Pokemon. Um, but he might not end up as a permanent member, purely because we did use Victory Bell in the last LP. Um, and so it might be a bit boring if I just go through the game with a Victory Bell again. Um, plus there are tons of other grass types uh, in this gen. Grass Poison. I can think of at least two. Uh, being... Um, Venusaur and... Oddish. I swear there's another one as well, so, yeah. So we're gonna grab our encounter up over here too, because why not? Um... Hmm. Yeah, actually, I'm sure Goza will not wreck whatever it is. Ooh, it's a Ponyta! A wild Ponyta appeared. This is a new one. We went through the nine tails before. Ooh. It, it's got more than eight HP, right? I'd be really disappointed if it doesn't. Enemy Ponyta used Ember. I don't want to lick that. So I'm gonna throw a Pokeball. Damn. I know what we could do. Those was burned? How rude. Confuse Ray. You burnt my Gengar! How rude! I don't want to hit it! I don't! I'm going to use my potion so that it can... Hit yourself in confusion! Come on, you dumb Ponyta! Yes, there you go. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Yes, that's catching range. Go Pokeball! 
Come on, Ponyta! You want to stay in the ball, right? Or, or not. Ponyta! Ponyta! Come on, bro! Stay in the ball! Join us! You want to be on our team! Yay! We caught a Ponyta! Ponyta was caught! New Pokedex data will be added for Ponyta! Fire Horse! Its hooves are ten times harder than diamonds! It can trample anything completely flat in little time. Do you want to give it a nickname? Yes. I don't know what I want to nickname it, though. Actually, yes, I do. I'm not sure how you spell it, though. One second. Okay, so I have a nickname for it. Sorry, I just had to look up how to spell it. Are you going to name him? Shadow Facts. Is that why is there two X's? I don't know. We're gonna name him Shadow Facts. Because Shadow Facts is cool in all the rings, so yeah. Let's take a look at our pony pony. Oh yeah, Gengar's burned. Stats. It just says Ember. Now we can scoop up one, maybe two more encounters in this episode if we really want. But then we won't have another encounter for a while. Should we do that? Should we scoop up some more encounters, guys? I think I'll scoop up Route 2 and save Viridian Forest's encounter for next episode. That sounds like a plan, doesn't it, guys? Your Pokémon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again! Uh, you know what, I'm going to buy some more Pokeballs, just because I only have two. Um... Hi there, may I help you? Let's buy three more. So we have five in the bag. Thank you, Sean. trainers on this route, is there? I don't think there is. Why did I all of a sudden just think, hang on a minute, am I going to have to battle someone? There's no one here! Of course I'm not going to have to battle anyone. What am I going about? They're clearly insane. Oh, our first encounter! Is a Jolteon! It's Sparks! It's Sparky, what the hell I named that Eevee that we were going to evolve into a Jolteon and then didn't. Sparky! You can name him Sparky. Nightshade. Quick attack. La 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 la. Ooh, you can take another nightshade. Mm. Thunder shock. Ooh, he's already got an electric attack move. You might be joining. You're definitely being a permanent member of the squad. Pokeball, go. Aww. I used sand attack, but it failed. Lol. I thought I bought... Maybe I only had one Pokeball. Why did I think I had more? Hey, Jolteon was caught! Noot, noot! New Pokedex and it will be added for Jolteon. It accumulates negative ions in the atmosphere to blast out 10,000 volts... ...lightning bolts. Do you want to give a nickname to Jolteon? Yes. Sparky! Sparky! Let's go heal Sparky up. Real quick like. 
Our team is coming together rather nicely, I, if I do say so myself. Obviously, we don't have the fishing rod yet, so we can't get a Viridian city in Calm 4. We'll have to save that till later. Welcome to our Pokemon Center. We heal your Pokemon back to perfect health. Yes, please. Down cushion. Your Pokemon are fighting fit. We opt to you again. I don't know why Nurse Joy is German. So we have Sparky! The Jolteon! The Tackle Sun Attack, Quick Attack, and Thunder Shock. Ooh, four moves! Nice, nice, nice. Um, let's put you here up front. And Shadow Fax here. Actually, Shadow Fax is a lower level, so we'll put Shadow Fax up front. We need to do some dr training. Training, training, training. Might do a grinding montage for the next episode. Purely because I want them to be a decent level. And then we can fight blue and then go into Viridian Forest and get the Viridian Forest encounter in the next episode. Let's see what else is on this route just for the lols. Because I mean, we only encountered that Jolteon. It's a meow! Wild Meowth up here. I'm kind of glad we got the Jolty on now. Go Shadowfax! Ember! How rude! Why is he now outspeeding me? Is it a speed tie? Well, Growl's gonna do nothing because I mean, I outspeed you. Uh, fire is special! And even after the fire, there's a special split. Ember is a special move. Stop, stop it, stop it. Naughty, naughty meow. Die. You know. Fuck you A wild needer and female appeared. It's Miss Kaiju, she's back. Ha! Thundershark. Boom! Taste my stab. <laughs> it was a crit and everything! Noise. Ah, tackle. Puny tackle. Boom. Oh, that one didn't do as much. Sad. Thundershark. Level up. Oh. So yeah, what I'll do is I'll grind them up uh, in between this episode and the next episode. You, uh, I'll show a grinding montage so you can see what everything that happens. Um, obviously, even if they paint in the grinding montage, they are considered dead. So I'll let you know if that happens. Um, but yeah, uh, thank you for watching. Be sure to smash the like button if you're hyped. Just now that we have actually officially started the Nuzlocke. Um, be sure to share with your friends, considering the season's... Season? Season? We're now on Netflix, apparently. The series has started, so people can catch it right from the start. Uh, and yeah! Subscribe, if you haven't already, if this is your first time visiting my channel. And be sure to check out my other videos, and be sure to tune in Monday for Episode 3! So yeah!